This is the new America. Black, brown, Asian, LGBT, immigrants. The country is going through a major demographic shift, and the numbers show it. My name is Maria Hinojosa. I'm the executive producer and anchor of a new public television series called America by the Numbers with Maria Hinojosa. We are making, as we speak, a new America. And that's a marvelous moment in American history. My whole life has been about living the new America, the multicultural America. Um, but as a kid, I never saw myself reflected in the news media. So my entire career has basically been dedicated to telling the stories that I knew were invisible, but that existed. Welcome to Clarkston, Georgia, one of the most diverse square miles in the American South. The reason why I've been able to do this, I think, is because I really believe in the mission of telling these stories and giving the voiceless a voice um, and showing the real America in all of its diversity. When I started my career in the mainstream media, I was the first. I was the first Latina at NPR, literally the first Latina employee who was not cleaning. I was the first Latina correspondent at CNN. I was the first Latina correspondent at PBS. So a lot of firsts. And now I'm the first to launch my own television series, a national news program that is anchored and executive produced by a Latina journalist. And while we encounter all of these challenges, we have to change the narrative that if you don't see us, we will flip the narrative. We become the leaders of the conversation. We are understanding that this is our moment to lead. It's scary, but we have a mission to do this because we are the future of the United States of America. Today's target consumer is increasingly multicultural. The face of the US has changed and who we market to and how we do it has shifted. I created a television series called America by the Numbers with Maria Hinojosa because I want to tell the stories. I want to do journalism and reporting on this massive demographic shift that is happening in our country. You know, we are covering infant mortality in Rochester, New York. We're covering an oil boom on a Native American reservation in North Dakota. We went to Guam um, where we have the highest rate of soldiers serving in the American military with the lowest rate of services from the VA. And we did a story also in northern Idaho. The white population in our country is actually decreasing, except in northern Idaho, the white population is increasing. Um, so we're reporting about not only these multicultural communities, but what is happening to white America? Um, what is it like to live in a place that is overwhelmingly white at a time when the rest of the United States is dramatically changing? By 2043, we will be a majority non-white nation. Everybody's voice is important to this debate. We're all immigrants. We need to remember we were once strangers in a foreign land. I became an American citizen by choice. Uh, I was born in Mexico. So for me, there are some core things that I take really seriously, like the Constitution, like due process, like our Bill of Rights, like freedom of speech and freedom of the press. So I hope that with this television series on PBS, that what we're doing is we're inspiring more dialogue. I wanna put these faces, these stories, these places on television so that this new majority, this new mainstream says, that's me, I am powerful, I am visible, and I am represented. That is, to me, the core of a strong democracy. Behind every number, there's a story. America by the numbers. I'm Maria Hinojosa.